Hi, I'm CJ Altenberg with TransWest Truck Trailer RV in Frederick, Colorado. We have a very special video for you guys today. This is something that we're very proud to be a part of. Behind me is the giveaway trailer at the fifth annual 2022 1033 State Trooper Memorial Roping that will be held next weekend, September 24th and 25th. This is a, again, a, an event we're very proud to be a part of. Us and Logan Coach uh, donate this trailer. We do the wrap. Uh, this is gonna be the giveaway trailer at the roping. Again, next weekend, the 24th and 25th of September to the High Point Roper for the weekend. Uh, again, very proud to be a part of this. I mean, I can't say that enough. I mean, TransWest is, is very honored to be a part of it. They're a great group of guys to work with. This roping has really grown over the last few years. Uh, we're excited. Go out there, help support, good cause, and have a chance to win this trailer. Now, let's talk a little bit about this trailer. We'll do a brief walkthrough on it just so you can kind of see how it's equipped and what you have the opportunity to possibly win. So this is a 2023 Logan Coach Crossfire two horse bumper pull. This trailer is a little over 13 foot as far as the box length on it. It's six, nine wide and it's seven tall. So this has been a really popular trailer for us to sell. They make this in a two and a three horse bumper pull and a three and four horse gooseneck. Now, let's just kind of walk you through this. As you can see too, you're gonna to get to see this really cool wrap that our our uh, graphics company, Mammoth uh, Creative, over at Summit Bodies has done. Uh, again, it's a really cool wrap, really kind of signifies kind of what we're doing and, and being a part of this roping again. On a Logan, you're talking about a galvanized steel frame aluminum body. So we have the strength of the steel and then the lightweight and the finished look of an aluminum trailer. That galvanized steel is really strong. It's really durable. It's not gonna rust like black steel will. You have an eight year Structure warranty, a two-year hardware, and as long as you're the first owner, a lifetime corrosion warranty on the trailer itself. So they really stand behind that product. Uh, really basic, you have a two and five sixteenths ball, electric brakes on this trailer, a single manual hand crank jack on it. They incorporate this diamond plate on this front nose, which is gonna help protect from, you know, some of that road blast and rocks. On this trailer, you got a front tack room. Then you're also gonna have a swing out saddle rack. So two tier saddle rack. Below each rack for your saddles is gonna be a, a blanket pole. So you've got the ability to slide some blankets on there. You could eventually, if you wanted to, a third one probably could be added to this. I'd probably go up above. You'd have to take off some of this vortex lining and have it welded but you have the ability to do that down the road if you'd like. You've got your bridle hooks on the partition wall with carpet behind it, so you're not gonna have you know, your tack swinging against you know, metal, scuffing that up. It's also gonna deaden the noise behind there where your horses are actually standing. Now on these Crossfire models, on the hip side, you're gonna have one air gap with plexiglass. That plexiglass can be removed. So as you get into uh, you know, warmer months, want to get a little bit more airflow, there's a piece at the back that you remove and then you can just slide that out. I recommend putting that piece of aluminum back in there just so you're not losing that piece. This one here is the black steel wheels. That's standard on these. Two 3500 rubber torsion axles. Those are 15 inch wheels. And it really ties in with kind of the concept here of, of the graphics and the colors that were all incorporated in this. Now at the back here, you got dual 50-50 doors. These are independent. Your right-hand door is actually gonna have a weather strip over it. And that's just to basically when these two doors shut, just to close off that little bit of gap between them so we don't have you know the potential of moisture and dust working its way into the trailer there. But if you wanted to add a ramp, ramps could be added to these trailers as well. In the stall area here, you've got a padded divider. That vortex lining, it's like a bed liner. They incorporate it throughout the trailer. It's really strong, it's really durable. 
Uh, I also think it deadens a lot of the noise in these trailers. It's not, you know, it doesn't have that echoey sound that you get in a lot of trailers. Um, but this stuff is really stout and strong. You have this recessed paddle latch, so it's easy to slam and open shut. You get a couple LED lights in here, one above each horse. Now you have a wood floor on this trailer. It is Douglas wood fir, but Logan again takes it a little step further by going ahead and vortex lining those boards as well. Now listen, I'm not gonna tell you you're not gonna have to replace boards ever on this trailer, but the likelihood and the longevity of these boards really increases by putting that vortex lining on there. Again, really strong, really durable as far as that's concerned. As we get over to driver's side, you're gonna have a couple drop windows. So again, tail side, you have the plexiglass that can remove, but on this head side, you've got drop windows with jail bars as well. The jail bars have a release on the actual bar almost right in the middle there. So you can drop those down. You can lock these up as well. These have the same key that are gonna be on the tack door. So it's just one key needed for this trailer itself to lock up these drop windows, lock up the tack door. If you wanna lock up those rear doors, uh, they've got the actually kind of a, a cam latch on them. So you probably need a paddle lock for something like that. But you can completely lock this trailer up by taking those couple steps. Again, really cool design, really good trailer for a giveaway. Um, again, it's a 2023, Logan Coach Crossfire two horse bumper pull. We can offer these available to you. Again, we also have a three horse bumper pull. They come in a three and four horse gooseneck. So we can get you into one of those trailers as well. But what we really wanted to do is we just wanted to really promote this roping and the cause. And again, we are extremely proud to be a part of that here at TransWest. We're happy to team up with Logan Coach as well. I want to give a thank you to them as being part of this donation and this giveaway trailer. Again, let's take a look at that flyer because we want you to have the information. We want you to go out and support these guys. Again, it's next weekend, Saturday and Sunday, September 24th, 25th. It's at the Colorado State Fairgrounds in Pueblo, Colorado. This trailer will be given to the High Point Roper of the weekend. Again, go out there and support these guys. The 1033 state trooper memorial roping again we cannot say it enough how proud we are to be a part of this thanks for tuning in and have a good day